Hello everybody, welcome to Pro Tips Ogres, game number four, versus Kemri, which is like a good ogre team, I guess. Um, worst possible matchup. <laughs> They've got a block Tomb Guardian, they don't have Mighty Blow on their Tomb Guardians though, but then they also don't have, they don't have Bonehead. So, it's not the guy that the Chaos just played. Easy win. <laughs> Claw Mighty Blow level themselves a little bit. However, um, however, you still want to power level them, don't you? It is nice that he's missing a bit. Of, yeah, block blocks the real enemy, isn't it? As uh, as as old as well, he shouldn't be using his petty cash, should he? <laughs> um. Yeah, it's 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 a bit like it's a bit like lizard men, isn't it? In that you want you want to stick your sauras on their tacklers or on their block players to protect your skinks, and it's the same kind of deal with ogres. So yeah, obviously try and try to keep his one blitzer tied up on an ogre if possible. Just receive and make him concede. Is the play. Oh, you didn't get anything. All oh, right. I thought you meant he didn't spend his petty cash. He didn't spend his inducement money. Wow, what a madman! <laughs> yeah, Thomas, just punch them. Yeah, bludge, bludge break tackle. Yeah, that's that's the thing. You you know, I could see having a bludge break tackle guy, um, but I would only take break tackle if I had dodge and asaurus. To be honest, I wouldn't take it without dodge. Yeah, and when I did roll a power, I chose the fucking push. <laughs> Ugh. Jim Shard, 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 Jim I think he's got a good strategy though to get everybody and um, get them all together. You know, by giving me lots of blocks, it means that it's really bad having the the ogres together, isn't it? It really is bad having the ogres together. This one will be a bit free. Zunk can be the free one. So three dice first. Then a 2D with block. And then something else. Hey, you caught it. I don't even have a blitz here, do I?
3D, couldn't I? If I got the power. I guess I should have moved a snotling up in there. Oh, well. right, so I get to blitz the uh, Tomb Valley and then. Screen. Was it dodge? Oh yeah, because I went fucking stupid. Oh god. Derp. Good job I saw it was a dodge though, eh? Yes, I should have blitzed the throw right, yeah, and then no, but then I couldn't have then I could have blocked him, yeah, and then left the Tomb Guardian in contact, maybe. Hmm. It's hard, to be fair, look, it's hard to see these little shits, isn't it, when they're when they're behind a fucking wall of ogres. It's hard to see that guy. Come on. Come on, man. Yeah, all looking last game, in fact. Right. Did he dodge away then? No, he's still there. I think a three dice without block. More chance of a knockdown, isn't there? Even though it's a riskier action. I want to blitz his. Uh... Turn guard him. Could even have the base, base, base at that at this point. Hard to get the assists in, isn't it? Fuel pill blocks him, or he can hit the ball. I've gone too far forward. I should have been here.
<laughs> yeah, Travica. And new nails, yeah. Wow, greeted it. He greeted the block. What an absolute madman. He didn't triple down it. <laughs> Not the sank. <laughs> that is pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, he's okay, he's not really doing anything. Alright, block with block. He's then got to go there, hasn't he? To protect his boneheaded pal. Could foul there, I guess. Is it worth activating? I've got to activate this one. Because it's just too easy to two dice me down, wasn't it? This one. For, for Bonehead, it gives a 2D. But if I don't, it's got a 2D anyway. Up, up, bash, bash, bash. Mm. Oh, wow. Ogre's not getting knocked over is pretty good, isn't it? When they're getting two dice. He just he gets the one dice. Shit. I was I was scared about this guy basing the ball, but obviously I should have been scared about him just straight up blitzing the ball. He didn't blitz the ball. <laughs> Could just have three dice on the ball. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, not not badly hurt. He's dead. He's dead. Oh well. Not badly hurt that time. Wow, I can't believe he didn't just three dice the ball. Instead went for a dodge and a GFI. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Why the fuck did he do that? <laughs> 
Right, you can explore through here then, eh? With a with a, with a pal here. No, just move him in first. Oh god, block. Hmm. Now the exploding through doesn't really look like an exploding through. Could block him and blitz him, maybe. Quite like him just basing him. Just risky, isn't it? Could do the dodge. Maybe blitz this way. Yeah, maybe that's safe already. Eh? Choose the right thing. I'm a seven. Good. Be nice to for I'm a seven to break. I was just thinking, as it duly did. It's quite punishing to roll boneheads here, but I've got to keep trying to hit the two dice when I'm just going to get two dice anyway, aren't I? So. No they, no, they don't down the strength zero now, so it's actually just a miss next game. Should have got the pushing. <laughs> oh man, that was bad, wasn't it? That was a bit of a bad bonehead, but he was just going to two dice with a team guardian anyway, wasn't he? So he's down at nine, you've got ten. He's got loads of reserves though. It's a shame that the runner badly hurts ended, but yeah, it's still just a missed this game. Yeah, I guess the badly hurt. At least he would have taken up the Tomb Guardian, whereas now it's it's, it's lost me and Ogre and got him a Tomb Guardian, hasn't it, that bonehead? Hmm. Wow, he likes, he likes blitzing with his Tomb Guardian, doesn't he? He likes blitzing Snotlings with his uh, Tomb Guardian. Maybe he thinks the strength too. Great, he's just dicking around with his three tomb guardians there.
No oh, shit. No, thank you, little cunt. Ah, the TG's on four star player points, fair enough. I'll do the block coming in first. Oh god, it was a ball down. Too good. Three D. Taz. Oh brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> Jim Polite. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's pretty good. Shawnee. Right, screen with Olgers. Oh, <laughs> cast him, cast him for the foul. That's what you get when you stamp on Tony's head. That fucked. Oh god, Ogres are pretty fun, aren't they? <laughs> Who knew? <laughs> Who knew having six mighty blow guys can be fun? Backyard Dodo gets gets low from that. Yeah, that did help Wolfbar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brett and Hogan's. <laughs> uh oh, he's 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 freed his blocker. Oh man. Maybe I shouldn't have appled the KO. Because um, I'll have two chances to get it back if I score one. Or... But I just like appling the first KO as Ogres. Or like first Kaz on an Ogre or first KO on an Ogre. Oh man. Get sent off. You got sent off. Boys, Shit, you got lads, injured. Boys, lads, boys. Jimmy is enjoying this WASNT part of the plan. <laughs> WASNT. No, I should have uh, should have saved the apple, shouldn't I? But it it lost him his blitzer, so now he's fucked. Which is nice. Yeah, when I decided to up, I thought he's just going to get fucking fouled again here, isn't he? But. Hmm, it's a bit disappointing. He's lost four. He's got two reserves. Oh, he's only lost three because this will get back. So he's lost three and he's got two reserves. So he's down to ten in the second half. One of these was a regen, wasn't it? Four, five, six. 
Seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, ten max for the second half. Come <laughs> on. Oh, oh that fucking apple. Maybe I want apple chaos in the future. Not when I think I'm gonna score. Because a hundred percent to come back instead of seventy five isn't. Probably isn't that worth it, is it? But he hasn't got mighty blow, so I figured it's not too dangerous for the rest of the game. If he'd had a mighty blow, even I don't think I would have uploaded it. Make sure I can't reach us. Might assist with him. Nah, it's not worth it, is it? Well, it is, because I don't have... Oh. Yeah, he might remove more, might he? Yeah, make sure he doesn't get removed. Might get another foul in, but if he does, he might get sent off again. <laughs> yeah, I still had to re-roll, but I mean, I was, I was, I was willing to re-roll the, uh, the one dice. You know, if it was a skull, I would have taken them both down. Obviously, with a block, but even with the other guy. He's not doing bad here, is he? Getting the extra block. Apart from making a GFI for no reason, that was pretty bad. Hopefully, we'll get another guy sent off and won't hurt. Now I'm a nine thick school player. Oh, but he was like, yeah, they are actually pretty much, pretty much wrecking face, yeah. Made three cars regen one, and he got sent off. His blitzer got sent off, which is just, just glorious, isn't it? His one blitzer. Out. <laughs> got another good guy sent off. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for fucking fouling, dickhead. Right, so if he, if he doesn't bonehead, then we blitz a tomb guardian. But because he did, we'll blitz this guy. <laughs> 
two SPP for the bonehead. That would be amazing, wouldn't it? Power level them. That'd be good, at least when you have that turn when you like fail four boneheads or whatever, four or five, or even all six. I mean, it's rare that you fail all six though, because you can probably stop making them. See, this is why I did Apo a KO, to be fair. Obviously he stays knocked out. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't both of them stay knocked out? Um... I'm just going to put the ogres and hope that they don't die. Seems I've already got quite a few people off the pitch. Both KOs had come back. I would have probably put snots on the LOS. But, um. How many has he got? Three, six, nine players. Four, ten. Maybe 11. Yes, that's true, Imperator Augustus. Yeah, that's true. Nurgle were the toughest team that we played. Uh, Ogres were in there twice, though, isn't it? They're only 2 1 0. Yeah, Ogre's Goblin, Nurgle, and then Camry. Pretty amazing. <laughs> Ogre's good choice, second best from birds. <laughs> Throwing him, I would have thrown him in the middle one. Let's see, let's see if I would have got it. Oh no, never look. Do you know what, Darkson? By the way, by the way, if you ever see Darkson on the on the Blood Bowl two forums, he said that. He saw a game, where, or he played a game, where either he or his opponent scored two defensive one-turn touchdowns from a blitz. So, if Darkson says anything ever, you know he's a lying piece of shit. Oh my god, really? I should just put snots on the LY, shouldn't I? I just told him to tempt him into a foul, that was the thing, and then he'll get sent off. Was my thinking. At least it was just badly hurts. Really regretting appoing the appoing the uh appoing the KO now though, holy shit. Like scoring on the blitz turn, zero, zero turn Shawnee, catching it in the end zone. Catching it in the end zone. Not a one turn. Actually a thrown teammate on defence. So you're playing halflings and you don't have your trees on the LOS. You have them off the LOS, so you can fucking throw a can you, so you can throw a fucking halfling, and he lands and runs in the end zone and catches the and catches the fucking kick that landed in the end zone. I mean, fuck off. Not talking. He didn't throw somebody and then score in one turn. He's scoring zero turns. Yeah, Monty did that. Yeah, Monty did that. In God knows how many games of goblins, and it's like and it's like fucking nuts. And he's like, it's not that crazy. I've, to, I've, I've had it happen twice in one game. No, you fucking haven't. You fucking bell end. 
Right, no ogres. This is rough now, isn't it? I've got to go. <laughs> I outnumbering him, but for how long? That's, that was really brutal in making the second cars. And I guess I should have uploaded one of. I shouldn't have uploaded the KO, and then I, you would have probably come back. And I could have uploaded the badly hurt. Mm. Fuck. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, good it was him. Oh, yes! <laughs> the, the fucking... Did he apple? Oh, he regened, I mean, even. Oh, it's a shame he regened. It'd be funny if Decay had killed him. Oh, pseudonym died. Oh. Well, that's a fair trade, though. I'll take that. I'll take a dead Tomb Guardian for a dead snot. Decay killed him. Oh, man, it would have been amazing if he hadn't regened. <laughs> He was gonna get sacked anyway because he got a skill. I mean, he probably was gonna. Uh, he was probably gonna get sacked. Oh well, that evens up the score a bit, then, doesn't it? With Henry down at Tomb Guardian. Oh, fuck off! How lucky has he been? How how fucking lucky has he been though? Holy shit! Three knockouts and two cars. Fuck off. That's crazy. Without Mighty Blow. If he had Mighty Blow, I wouldn't have had both the KO. Yeah, that evens up the score. Insta KO, yeah. <laughs> yeah, hell no. <laughs> the classic. God, that, that really grinds my gears, that. That really is the thing that grinds my gears the most. With people who play Blood Bowl. Well, people who talk about Blood Bowl online probably don't actually play it themselves. At least he's not basing the snots for three dice blocks. I mean, I guess I'm just two plus away with a reroll, but... Could still fail one, couldn't you? Yeah, it is stupid. The counter of Guardians is absolutely fucking stupid. Ruins the team. Alright, let's go, Broger.
Oh, don't. It's up to you. Let's keep him uh, screened. Get a snot in the backfield. That's pretty bad, Mr. Yamanda. VIP Mr. Yamanda. Getting my augers knocked down every turn isn't a really good play, is it? Good, good plan, is it? Oh man, stop breaking. Well, it, his dice have been insane. I know he's had a fucking Tomb Guardian lost to a rock, but holy shit, he's just... The fucking injuries he's done to these ogres is insane. It's just a GFI for no reason. Oh my god, man. Good. Justice. I would if it was minus two D barbecue sack. <laughs> it's minus three D, isn't it? Which is uh, it makes me not want to try. But now he's let us have a one dice. Not even hard to get a one dice on the ball there. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going there. I could just blitz the Tomb Guardian. And stand in the front and then just double tag him. But I think this GFI is worth it. Glorious. I did an extra one for no reason. <laughs> Forgot that I'd based. Forgot that I'd moved him there. No <laughs> kill. <laughs> oh, pretty funny. Extra, extra, extra dodge for no reason. Doesn't matter. <laughs> dare you question the BBRC? Go play chess. Yeah, that's the first time I've probably seen ever seen that animation. Oh, I should have GFI'd with him, shouldn't I? Or not followed. Moved him at the end and GFI'd to screen off. The other rogues have been fucking bashed to fuck. Two cars, one KO. Only badly hurts, thank God.
<laughs> oh man. This is pretty funny. I could have picked it up. I actually could have done, yeah. I actually could and probably should have done, you're right. I just didn't even think about it. I was just like, haha, I've popped it. Yeah, I just could have done, yeah, you're absolutely right. Absolutely fucking right. Don't know why I didn't. Just some shit at Blood Bowl, I guess. Oh my god, he's breaking armor! Every... Every block! This is fucking insane. I'm gonna chain him on, on the ball and see what happens. Quite like him having him there though, if the ball goes into the crowd for the potato. Just two two dodges, isn't it? So I could do, try this guy first. Oh but then he's no oh, no they're both good. No, they're both good. Equally as good if it goes the wrong square. So if you use dodge, use the other one. Got block as well, that's helpful, isn't it? Oh, there it is! It's, it's there for him! <laughs> oh, excellent! Excellent! Was pretty good, wasn't it? If I make two GFIs, one, two, three, four, five, two GFIs next turn, and I could use a reroll on that. Um. I could minus 2d surf him, I guess. Could use the reroll on the pickup. I guess I don't have to. If I, if I make it surf first, I don't have to use the reroll on the pickup. One, two, three, four, five. So we could get him to there or something. Double one. Oh well. I mean that's okay, isn't it? Because he's there next to, next to it to pick it up anyway. Go here, right? Stop. Oh, I thought he's. I thought he'd hit with this one. I didn't realize that stops him hit blocking the ogre. Though, so that's pretty good. You can get punched again, <laughs> scrub Jimmy. <laughs> Oh wow, 
Oh, the snotlings are much better at getting punched than the ogres are. Or were, anyway. Yeah, maybe I should have gone for the uphill. Uphill serve. But I mean, I thought they're so slow that I don't need to. Do I just need to break away, mate? Do those dodges. Wow, one dice block. Fuck you. Not an armor breaker. Outrageous. One, two, three, four, five. He can dodge and base him at the end. That's pretty good. In fact, I don't even need to dodge with him, I could just blitz with the, uh, blitz with a block guy. Hmm, not anymore. He could GFI to base him. Okay. Okay, so he stands up first. He can dodge to base him. At the end, he can give. Oh no, he can. He can. Mm, he can blitz him. And if it's a push, base him himself. So he can just go first. Keep him where he is. Right, so now this bat's not going to base him, so there's two to screen it. Oh, baby. <laughs> There's a chance. <laughs> yeah, you hardly knocked over something. Yeah, that's true, yeah. Turtle up and just hurt. I nah, just pick it up and run away and skull. <laughs> yeah, me too, because anyway, it was snots, wasn't it? The snots got a one nice block on the ball, and then the snots recovered and skull. <laughs> Three August, maybe six. It was right after all. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> it's crazy the ta the percentage of armor breaks he's got without mighty blow on ogres is is actually insane. Although yeah, he didn't knock over those. Maybe he didn't knock over the snots as much as he could have done. But then he hasn't got block. He's only got he only had one block guy who was on a stuck in an ogre all game. Um, so you wouldn't expect him to power the snots that much about half the time, innit? <laughs> Do you reckon squirrel? <laughs> yeah, you would think the snotlings were ogres, yeah, they always were snotlings. Um so the block guy's stunned, so he's not doing anything. I think we just base people with these. Oh, derp, base, base, base. And then obviously just try to go two nil up. The GFI with a reroll.
thank God. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, thank God for that. Oh man, these brokers. Brokers got fucked, but at least the snots were good. I think I think I can't lose now. In fact, can't draw two nil up. Against <laughs> fucking Camry. <laughs> yes. They have been great matchups though, to be fair for the Ogres. They have been great matchups. Goblins, Ogres, Camry, and uh, Nurgle. Snot LOS. Uh, I guess so, yeah. I guess I should have gone full Snot LOS, you're right. Because the game's over. Just need to not have Ogres kill killed, basically. Oh, well. Ha ha ha. Right. Alright, let's have the old rule of rule of three set up. you play this in a game boy <laughs> i know i win okay i am sorry about the quality of the stream it'll be better though soon you know hopefully january will be back still got stuff to do i did actually stream with my phone the other day because the internet went down badly hurt glorious uh oh Should have gone here, shouldn't have for less assist for the foul. Didn't even get his armor, bro. <laughs> oh shit, block, here comes the block guy. I didn't even need it. <laughs> God, I'm alive. <laughs> It's only the ogres that are in any danger. I'm sorry, I should have seen who got skills and put the ones with skills on the LOS. <laughs> the ones with star player points. Most important thing is to get the, uh, the leveled up snots killed, isn't it? <laughs> Can't believe this. This record though, eh? Ogres. 3-1-0. I feel like I should sit on this record for a bit now. It might be the top orgas, might it? Three one zero. Pretty good win rate. I mean, uh, if I played Z Zons or Elves, I would have lost. I'm sure. Even or even humans or orcs. Two and all was the top orgas in PS4. <laughs> wow, holy shit. I mean, it's not even surprising, really, is it? Because, you know, they're shit, aren't they? Can I get a two dice with this guy? Maybe.
I don't really want to get punched. Smash him to pieces. <laughs> yeah, boy. Best team since sliced bread. Oh yeah, throw a snot. Oh yeah, I guess could have just thrown a snot. And just could have scored. I didn't think about that, but yeah, I could have just thrown a snot and scored, couldn't I? <laughs> but I was just trying to, you know, take less blocks. Was the point of that. Not dead. No, I'm, I'm not talking down PS4 or that. I'm just saying it's not surprising that because there's less games, isn't there, on the PS4? I wasn't. I wasn't dissing it. <laughs> That's true, Shawnee. <laughs> um, because SV398 okay I'll give you a history lesson right Blood Bowl is actually a board game uh, originally a board game not a computer game and in the board game ogres had goblins on their well originally ogres had snotlings on their team and then ogres had goblins on the team and then ogres had snotlings on the team and then, <laughs> for some reason, the, when they made the computer game, they decided to not call them Snotlings, they decided to call them Noblars, even though they have the exact same stats. So, but now, in the latest version of the Tabletop Blood Bowl, they're not called Snotlings or Noblars, they are called um, Runts, which is the 40k thing. Because I guess, I guess they can like copyright Runts, or whatever, whereas they can't, the other ones. It'll be something to do with the copywriting. Or, uh, what is it called? Intellectual property, won't it? It'll be something to do with that. For the same reason as you've got Astra Militarum rather than, uh, rather than Imperial Guard anymore. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Well, SV398, obviously you can't write a damn PhD on Blood Bowl, <laughs> so <laughs> maybe you shouldn't come in here with your attitude. <laughs> Just a thought. Just a thought for you there. Could have, could have thrown the ball and scored a touchdown, but instead just tried to block somebody. Got KO'd. No, it's not actually SV398. No, it's not. So I guess you've just failed your PhD there. Unlucky, buddy. Um... Oh, well, that's a, that's a shame for you, isn't it? Eh? I, c you know, there, there's there's no there's no PhD for you if you think Blood Bowl's a part of the Warhammer Fantasy world. Sorry, bud. You done goofed. <laughs> <laughs> Completely and utterly wrong. Feel feels bad, man. <laughs> Some salt, courtesy of Professor SV three hundred ninety eight. <laughs> 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 oh, what about the chainsaws? Chainsaws? Are there, are there, are there chainsaws in Warhammer? Do, do like... Do do chaos? Do, do followers of corn? Just to hang out, like, don't get... <laughs> you know, like, just just walk freely around the Empire playing games for fun? Or, um, but, uh, yeah, never mind it. Eh? 
you literally don't know anything about Blood Bowl if you think it's the same, if it's the same thing. <laughs> For this poor professor. Yeah, um, even though you came in and were an asshole, I'll be nice because, you know, I am Blood Bowl's Mr. Nice. So I'll be nice. Even though, even though you weren't nice to me, I'll be nice to you. It is different. It is different. Um, Blood Bowl came out in like 90, well, the first one was shit in 1988. No, no, actually, no, the first one's before it. I think the first one was 86, and it was shit. But then, the second edition Blood Bowl was the best, and that came out in, like, 1988. And the guy who created it, Jervis Johnson, said, it's not in the Warhammer universe. It, it's a parody. It's not in the future, which which some people some people thought, because the origin of it was... Uh, was they, they find uh, dwarves and orcs having a battle and they like, they find like a dome and uh, it's all dusty and everything. And it's like, you know, to be fair, it's like an American football one, but then it's not, it's, it's Blood Bowl. So, you know, it's, it's, it's a bit like, it's more, it's more actually like Earth way in the future than the Warhammer way in the future, to be honest. But it's, it's, it's just a parody of the Warhammer world. It's not actually the Warhammer world. And even if it was actually the Warhammer world, um, ogres, ogres used to be worth with Snotlings back in 1986 anyway. And uh, they have been with them in the Blood Bowl game until, until only Cyanide have called it Noblars for some reason. Anyway, 17 AV breaks he made against 9. And the, the crazy thing is, most of those were ogre armor breaks. Like, obviously, you expect your snotlings to get broken. I don't think you'll be able to see which were which. Were which. But 85% um, bonus, pretty good. Easy win with ogres there, wasn't it? Yeah, last frogman almost with the second level. He can, get, he can get a cheeky touchdown. Now he's got break tackle. He'll be, he'll be a good ball carrier as well. <laughs> Um, to get the to get the touchdown, and then backyard Dodo can get the guard, so we'll get the we'll get the guard for the LOS right now, unless it's unless it's block. No, it's not. So we can easy take the guard there and see what BZL gets. Probably sacked for having the goal to level. <laughs> Because I get diving tackle, I guess. Diving tackle, then then he's like vaguely got a tackle zone. I think he'll get. I think he'll get diving tackle. Okay, so thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.